Ike Perlmutter has been cut from Marvel Studios. Welcome back to Views with Hughes and Jennifer News. This is Jerome Hughes. And if you have done so already, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Click the bell notification so that way you will be notified of future uploads and updates. So we see here from Deadline, Marvel Entertainment Chairman Ike Perlmutter has been cut from the company. So we all knew that he was still there with the studios, but he just was in the face of it. Like um, Kevin Feige. So we see here that the... um. Um, a distant spokesperson confirmed that he's been let go and he's out of the company. Now he oversaw the consumer products division of Marvel and is part isn't part of the Kevin Feige led Marvel Studios. Okay, so just to make a long story short, Ike Perlmutter he was the one he was one of um few who was against the agenda that Marvel Studios was looking to put out there with this content. Okay. So this comes at a time where um Bob Iger is making a lot of cups and cutting a lot of jobs. As um recently reported, it was seven thousand, but it could be upwards to oh, like about around twenty one thousand. Okay, so it says here that his uh, departure comes amid Disney cutting seven thousand jobs, like I just said, and it's trying to save like five point five billion dollars. Okay, to position the Mo Mouse House even more for streaming obsessed in entertainment era okay so pearl mother's marvel pearl mother's marvel entertainment will be folded into other parts of disney corporate umbrella okay so just basically this is going to upset a lot of people right now okay it's going to upset a lot of people right now because of the fact that they actually thought that they were going to do away with what content but remember victoria alonzo was fired okay it wasn't because of the fact that she was woke it was because of her performance it wasn't good enough and bob Iger's eyes so the thing is i guarantee you this is going to continue with woke okay we see that already star wars is going to continue and begin the era of the high republic with the acolyte and now we're starting to see the same kind of principle being led within marvel studios okay so um, Pearl Mother's star, he's been falling since falling since he was at war with Marvel President Kevin Feige, where he was trying to fire on um, Kevin Feige, but Bob Iger was this um intervened to make sure that didn't happen. Okay, because of the fact that Bob Iger took Kevin Feige's side. So he was um stated that Pearl Mother oversaw the consumer products division of Marvel, and he's not a part of the Kevin Feige led Marvel Studios. Pearl Mother sold Marvel to Disney in 2009 for $4 billion, having previously steered the company during the 1990s, capitalizing on the comic book label's superhero merchandising business. business. But he wasn't the big integral part of the film company's success with the Marvel movies, okay, from Marvel Studios, okay? And it's like he basically went to war, starting starting with the whole Doctor Strange thing with Kevin Feige with the production um thing. That's what made him want to keep fight um Kevin Feige. But CEO Bob Iger at the time, back in 2015, has stated that in an interview he couldn't let that happen. Okay, so he told CNBC that he'd initially promised Perlmutter that he could continue to run Marvel after the acquisition, or after it was purchased, but not forever so in other words he was um saying that he it wasn't a permanent position for him okay and he was you know intent on firing kevin feige but um i got thought that it was be a huge mistake and he stepped in to prevent that from happening like i just mentioned okay so he has a lot of favors high favors of kevin feige even though the fact that the company itself isn't really doing so well with the movies and the shows all right, so there's no love lost between Ike Perlmutter and Bob Iger, but Iger wasn't really happy about it, okay? But um, there was there's Disney Insider stating that Perlmutter's um, departure was actually inspected because of the fact that it makes sense as Iger couldn't afford to have angry people gunning for each other inside Marvel in the aftermath of Victoria Alonso's um firing. So in other words, there was a big civil war possibly happening um between the um behind the scenes at Marvel Studios. But none of this means that Kevin Feige isn't safe himself. He could be also in a hot seat if his performance isn't doing well. If because 
seems to me like lately he left everything up to Victoria Alonso where he couldn't he was not be doing anything putting anything out there so it's like he could be on the chopping block as well of course we don't know that but you never know it might come up someday but as the um, many Disney sources have said Feige he must make the Marvel movies profitable again so if he can't do that he's going to be gone and let go so per mother's departure, um, maybe a step, another step just to cleaning out the house of mouse inside Marvel after Alonso step one and soon maybe we might hear of Kevin Feige himself being removed. All right. Hollywood is like being actually primed for a possible outcome of letting uh, Kevin Feige go as removal of two powerful people within the Marvel um, studios hierarchy, if you will will no longer stay around to make um Kevin Feige's fall seem impossible to the industry, okay? So, let me know your thoughts about this in the comments below. What do you think? How you feel about Ike Perlmutter being let go? Because I know that they fired him, okay? Bob Iger planned this from the giddy-up. That's in my, in my opinion, okay? So, let me know your thoughts below. Let me know what went wrong in the video. Also, do you think that he's actually going to continue with the woke content out there with the whole ESG model and DEI initiative? Go ahead, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Also, if you enjoyed what I stated in the video, go ahead and share, um, share your thoughts below and smash the like button and share far and wide across social media. If you haven't done so already, you enjoyed all the content I put out there, go ahead and subscribe to the channel, click the bell notification, so that way you will be notified of future uploads and updates. Until then, peace.